For all of you who have been waiting for me to create a video for neuropathy, ta-da, here it is today, finally. And I want to just start off by saying, if you're enjoying my work here on this channel, please like this video, please subscribe to me here on YouTube for a cool reason. YouTube shows my content to people who may never have seen it before based on the number of subscribers I have. So somebody that needed help might get it today because you took a second and clicked subscribe. So thank you in advance. Now I made this video in two parts. For this first part, we're gonna do just some regular EFT tapping. Feel free to make this specific to your situation. For instance, if you have neuropathy in your left foot, I'm just gonna be saying neuropathy. Feel free to change the wording to say my left foot, okay? And I'll talk to you about the second part when we get to it. So let's just start out outside of the hand, just doing some tapping. I have neuropathy. It may be in more than one area. And I choose to be okay anyway. Even though I have neuropathy, it may be peripheral or another kind. It may be in one area of my body or many. I completely love and accept myself. Even though I've got neuropathy, I choose to be okay because I completely love and accept myself. And I love all the nerves in my entire body. I allow myself to understand that my body communicates with me through nerves. I wonder if there are some places where I may not be communicating with myself very well. I may be sending myself mixed signals. My thoughts may not match my language. I may not be communicating clearly with other people. Maybe I felt like I couldn't. And I have neuropathy. I allow myself to be open to the possibility that there's nothing wrong with my nerves. That I need to relax and allow clear communication. It's safe for my nerves to feel. It's safe for me to feel. Even though there may have been times when it didn't feel safe. I allow myself to relax and release the need to have pain, numbness, tingling, or burning sensations. None of these are pleasant. They represent miscommunication. They may represent communicating bad things with myself.
pain and numbness may indicate that I feel guilty about my communication with someone. And it's safe to let that go now. As I allow myself to relax and release numbness, release tingling, release pain, it's safe to let it go. I allow my nerves to function at their optimal capacity without pain because I can, because I completely love and accept myself and I love all the nerves in my body. Peace. Okay, now we're gonna move into the second part of this. For this part, I'm gonna have you simply tapping the outside edge of your hand, either hand, either side, and just rest your hands in your lap. There's no need to hold them up and just tap gently throughout this. And I'm gonna have you relax and close your eyes here in a moment. Do not change the wording in this. What we're doing in this is something completely different. This is me guiding you through using your own self-compassion to deliver healing to all the wounded younger versions of yourself for these specific things. So don't change the wording up in this. All right, and just begin tapping. Now take a big breath into your nose. Hold it. And blow it out. And just relaxing while you tap and close your eyes. And here we go. I'm so sorry you have all this pain and numbness. I'm so sorry that they taught you to block love because it wasn't safe. I'm so sorry that you may have learned to feel guilt around your feelings. I'm so sorry that no one ever loved you just the way you were. I'm sorry that you may have learned that you deserved punishment when you didn't. I'm so sorry, when you needed help, nobody came to help you. I'm so sorry you felt that somewhere in there you'd done something to deserve pain and suffering. Even though you didn't know what you'd done. I'm so sorry you can't just relax and forgive yourself. I'm so sorry that you have to hang on to all this pain I'm so sorry that when you tried to block the things that didn't feel good, you also blocked the things that did feel good. I'm sorry it was too terrifying to allow the flow of your emotions. So you learned to just shut them off. And now you have neuropathy. I'm sorry you can't just relax and open the dialogue with your entire nervous system again. I'm 
I'm sorry that you had to hide your feelings in your nerves. I'm so sorry you're sad. Okay, good. Now stop and just appreciate how you feel in your body. Appreciate wherever you have neuropathy and just see how it feels now. We didn't measure at the start of this, but just have a look at it. Feel it. Good. All right. Now take a big breath into your nose and blow it out through your mouth. And open your eyes. You did great. I hope you're feeling better. And I hope you'll come back and use this one as often as you need. And leave me some comments, please. Let me know how this one lands for you, how it makes you feel, what effect it has. I love hearing from you. And I read and respond to every single one. So... Thanks for doing this work with me. I appreciate you, and I have so much love for you. I'll see you again soon.